finally made in the murder of a Hampstead teen. He was killed during a drive-by shooting that happened back in June. Let's get right to that scene in Hampstead and News 12 Long Island's Caroline Flynn with some new information this morning. Caroline, good morning. Erin, thank you and good morning. We are in the neighborhood where this horrific shooting happened just a few months ago. And police are now saying it was a 22 year old that was responsible for taking the life of a 19 year old teen, a beloved 19 year old teen, and injuring six other people. Now, new this hour and just into our newsroom, we want to get a picture up on your screen. This is the man police are saying is responsible. LaRon Watts, he's from Uniondale, and we've learned this morning that he has been charged with murder in the drive by shooting that happened on June 4th of this year. Now, it was around 10 that night. Police say they were called to reports of shots fired on Terrace Avenue. That's in Hempstead. When they arrived, they found 19-year-old Jaden Johnson badly injured. At the hospital, he died from his injuries. Six others were injured in this drive-by shooting. They were okay. Of course, suffered some, some pretty significant injuries. At the time, we know police, they told us that they were not sure if this was something that was targeted. His family, the community here, said he was a great kid. He was a happy kid, stayed out of trouble. They want justice served. They told us that at the time. They've been telling us that. That's been their message. And they also want answers. And we know that Watts is going to appear in court today. He's going to be arraigned on the murder charge. And we're hoping to get some answers there as well. So, of course, we're going to continue to keep you updated with what we learn. But for now, I'm going to send it back to you in the studio.